So the gym got picked up yesterday. I have no longer have a gym in there, but it is what it is. So today I've got a chap coming over to clear all of this down the side of the house. It's a six foot fence, probably 18 feet long and it bottlenecks down to the back. There is just so much here and it's unrealized space. I can get sheds in there. I can get storage containers, all sorts of stuff. So today, 400 quid and we're getting it gone. I told the group chat about me getting it cleared out and they're all crying about it saying, move it yourself, clear it yourself, separate the scrap metal, let the scrap metal come, get the wood, burn the wood, bag the rest, spread it around you and then, fucking hell, do you think if I had the time to do that, I wouldn't just do it. Sometimes money is worth less than time. This gets done today while I go to work. 400 quid, done, see ya. Come on. Am I happy about spending 400 pounds? No. <laughs> Am I unhappy about spending it? No, I'm neutral. It's just plastic. It's just a piece of plastic with a queen on it and some numbers that gets people to do things. That's it. It comes and it goes and it comes back again and it goes. Sometimes it comes in abundance. Sometimes it goes in abundance. Sometimes it comes in little amounts. Most of the time it goes in abundance. <laughs> but that's it, money comes and goes. It's supposed to be here at nine o'clock and it's just gone. So, oh, I can hear a van. This has to be him, surely. Yeah, that's him. That's definitely him. Right, I'll see you in a minute. Look at that, beautiful job. A load of rubbish clearance service. There's the contact details. Look at that. Fucking job. I can actually get a fucking shed in here now. All right, now that's done, it's time to go and do some actual work. It's half past 11, so I've got some catching up to do. Well, welcome back. Let's get cracking with some of these sales. I've got... 10 that needs to be posted within 24 hours and 12 in total so i'm just going to do the lot in no particular order dalek's mug it's a really nice one to be fair 3d all around all that jazzy stuff one pounds no 75p from a charity shop sold for 12 pounds 74 all in i've already filled it out I can't find my roll of tape, so I'm gonna have to crack open one of these. I've got two of these the other day. These are what you need to search for when you're looking for them on eBay. I'm not affiliated. I don't have a link or anything. I don't make any money from it. I don't even know who this company is that I buy them from, but they're the only ones that I see them popping up. If you want them, search that, Bantkez. I think it's Turkish. Whenever they come in stock, I always buy a few because these little rubber rings tend to perish over time, which is natural, it's normal. And you probably can buy different ones. It's just easy to buy them, isn't it? I'm gonna give this blue tape a go today. Not off to a fucking great start, are we? I reckon the company knew that the price was weird. I reckon they did it on purpose to make everybody go wild and buy it. Cause I'm a conspiracy theorist. This is, this is low noise tape as well. Fucking hell, it keeps breaking. That's absolute dog shit. Oh, this is terrible stuff, man. I'm glad when I told you about it, it went out of stock. Because imagine if I'd have sent you all to go and buy this. Low noise tape. Terrible stuff. Dobbins better buy these games quicker. I'm going to do a whatnot stream with them. I'm not really. Tom's tat did one yesterday. Look fucking manic. Well, I'm not going to film me packing all these. So I've got quite a bit to do, but I'll show you what the I'll show you what each thing is. You can't see me. Five pounds fifty for this stretch John Cena. It's manky, but I've mentioned that in the. I've mentioned that five fifty. The last Aran Circle Quach, I think they call it, sold for eight pounds ninety nine. The other two went GSP for like sixteen ninety nine. 14.99 each, something like that. A selection of manga books, there's five in there. They fit nicely into this box. I'm gonna pad it out, of course. They sold for 10 pounds all in. Some more books, Warhammer this time, some codexes and I don't know, a novel maybe. Sold for 13 pounds, 49 pence, all in. Next up, we have a Knit Master cartridge. This goes in like sewing machines and things like that. Sold for 16 pounds and 14 pence. Ah. Shut up. Low noise is such cap. I am very, very hot in here because the window faces in here. I've got the blinds closed, but this room is like an oven. So I might have to get naked soon. 
but I'll, um, I'll move the camera if so. A bunch of really quite used Dyson attachments sold for £10.80. You can get a lot more for these if you split them out and condition depending, etc. But these are used and not exactly the best ones, but £10.80, we'll take that. Well, I've had to do it, I've had to get naked, so I'm going to be cutting this video up, so it's probably a very zoomed in close shot of my head right now. We sold these Bally shoes, vintage, picked them up at the last end of a car boot sale that I was selling at, I went round and they were still there. £30 all in, sold the last pair for £49.99, beautiful. Next up, we have sold the lovely Mirror. It's beautiful, I absolutely love that. Where are you? Hello. I love it, it's fantastic. And it's gone to somebody who follows the channel, I do believe, so Caroline, thank you ever so much for your purchase, massively appreciated, and I'm a little bit jealous that I didn't have anywhere to hang it before you did. But I'm gonna get that on its way to you today. Sold for 40 pound free postage. Again, thank you so much, Caroline, I appreciate it. There is no airflow in here. I've tried to cover up the best I can, but I'm not actually bothered, if I'm honest. I'm just more thinking about you lot. <laughs> As you know. Nobody signed up to see somebody half naked, but also, if you want my OnlyFans, I can give you it. No, I do not have OnlyFans. Just the perfect box for that, Caroline. Low noise tape, it's an absolute scam. If I didn't get this stuff so, so cheaply, I'd be complaining. Maybe it's silent if you've got this. But who's moving that slowly? Nobody. There you go, Caroline, that's on its way. Procook Leather Chef's Knives Organisation thing. It's like a leather belt that holds your tools. Uh, £8.99 free postage. Fisher Price walkie talkies, untested, unchecked spares, repairs, parts, props, etc. £11.69. It does have some signs of leakage in the batteries, I think it's this one. And then we've got a set of four of these speakers, which don't need to go out until tomorrow, sold for £13.49. So I'm not too bothered if I pack those or not. So what I'm gonna do is, I've gotta go back downstairs and get a trolley to bring all my stuff down. So I forgot to do that. So I'm gonna to have to go and do that. Hey, getting these ones there, rank. Scary. It's one of those days today where I've had a really slow start. So I've had to wait around for that chap to do his job. Great job, by the way. This is his company. If you're local to the area and you need some removal, definitely, definitely hit him up. Nice guy as well. And down to earth. This lift gets shakier and shakier and creakier and creakier every time I get in it. One day it's just gonna go zzz, snap. Parcels are on the trolley. Now I'll be real, the weather is looking fantastic for this weekend for car boot sale so i might fill up a couple of amazon bags full of stuff to take home and get sold at the car boot sales this weekend there's two saturday and sunday and the weather is looking mighty mighty fine so i think i might capitalize on that and get some stuff taken down yeah yeah i think i will i'm gonna get these two amazon bags filled and then just put them onto the trolley and leave so god knows if this video is even going to come out or not i've no idea what the storyline is what the concept is i don't know but if I'm saying goodbye and you're seeing it, thank you so much for sticking with it. I do appreciate it. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Love you all. See you on the next one. Bye.